Low, by Charles Hoyfort, Part 2, Chapter 23H. Spain, seems that, near Valencia, one of these nights, there was a rotten theatrical performance. Such a fall of big hailstones that a trial was stalled. Vast tragedian, in a black cloak, posing on the funnel of an engine, car windows that were footlights, and disapproval was expressing with the looks of millions of pigeons, eggs. Anyway, near Valencia, a fall of hail, three feet deep, stopped trains. Just where was all that sunshine? South Africa, moving pictures of the low degree of the now old-fashioned cereals. Something staged clutching hands. There were watery grabs from the sky, at Colesburg, Maraisburg, and Prisca. The volume of one of these bulks equaled one-tenth of the total rainfall in South Africa in one year. Snow, two months before its season, was falling in the Andes, floods in Paraguay, and people spreading in panic, government vessels carrying supplies to homeless, starving people, river Uruguay rising rapidly, heavy rains in the Fiji Islands, the rains in Tasmania, during the month of March, were 26 points above the average, Upon the first day of the floods in Ohio and four neighboring states, March 22nd, began a series of terrific thunderstorms in Australia. There was a rain blizzard in New South Wales. In Queensland, all mails were delayed by floods. New Zealand, Wellington Evening Post, March 31st, the greatest disaster in the history of the colony. Where there had been sluggish rivers, bodies of countless sheep tossed in woolly furies, Maybe there is a vast old being named God, and reported strands of tossing sheep were glimpses of his whiskers, in one of those wraths of his. In the times, there were fantastic savageries. Wherever the floods had been before, it looks as if they had been to college. One of them rioted through the streets of Gore, having broken store windows. It roistered with the bodies of animals, wrapped in lace curtains, silks, and ribbons. Down the Matura River sounded a torrent of terrible cries. It was a rush of drowning cattle. It was a delirium of brandishing horns, upon which invisible collegians were blowing a fanfare. Ohio and four neighboring states, the clip of Paraguay and the bob of New Zealand, the snip of South Africa and the shearing of everything else that did not fit in with a the theory. Whoever said that a pen is mightier than something else, overlooked the mightiest of all, and that's the scissors. Wherever all this water was coming from, the full counties of North America and four neighboring continents, 